Hi friends, now I will tell you about living happily ever after in marriage. Is it possible? And if yes, then how? We have seen that God has made men and women different. While they are incomplete by themselves, it is in marriage that they become complete and create a family that grows and seeks recognition in the society. The adjustments that both the partners need to make come slowly because each needs to know and understand the other better. Many factors influence married life. It takes time before stability is experienced. Sexual intimacy is in the couple plays a crucial role since the sex drive and needs vary from one individual to another adjustments are necessary while most men feel that they do not indulge too often in sexual intimacy most women feel just the opposite it is the way both look at it newly married couples desire and enjoy sexual intimacy almost every day after marriage but the frequency reduces gradually the frequency in middle age couples is twice a week in older couples it would be once a month sexual intimacy is a personal affair for a couple all desire that it should go on to be a pleasurable interaction throughout married life to make this possible both need to respect each other's feelings and sentiments they should not rob the relationship of its sanctity by taking about others in account or by using crude or vulgar language understanding couples recognize the rhythm of the monthly cycle of the wife women experience days of low responsiveness and high desire linked with the menstrual cycle well adjusted couples observe self restraint during the periods of low responsiveness followed by sexual intimacy regularly for 3 or 4 days during the period of high desire the couple finds this adjustment satisfying the excitement of marriage wanes when one or both of pa- the partners become complacent this problem is very common and yet it is not addressed in time this should not be allowed to happen marriage is a living relationship it must be nurtured every day life should not be allowed to become a monday mundane routine the couple must experiment with each other just as one is at one's best during the courting period or even the initial part of married life but most couples continue to surprise each other with new ideas and things even the physical relationship should not become a ritual followed in detail from one time to another the couple must experiment with each other they must search for new joys it must be a spontaneous act preceded by foreplay caressing and fondling it should not only give physical pleasure but must be a deep emotional experience that gives happiness to both the partners there could be no greater bliss than that of a happy married life this is no accident both the partners need to show care and concern for each other it is from this commitment that true love emerges and keeps the relationship alive it does not come easily the couple needs to work on it day after day to attain happiness hereafter or live happily ever after friends if you like my thinking about this topic do like comment and tell me what you felt about it share and subscribe to my channel take care and lots of love to you all